Every year, more than 200,000 people are diagnosed with something called essential tremor. It's a frustrating and sometimes embarrassing condition. It prevents patients from doing the most basic tasks. But health editor Dr. Maria Simber reports doctors are now helping stop the tremors. Don Wall was so self-conscious he wouldn't go out to eat. I couldn't eat with my right hand. I couldn't drink with my right hand. You know, even on a big spoon, I would shake it all off by the time I get it up here. He has a condition called essential tremor. It was drastically worse in his right hand, his dominant hand, and especially noticeable when he had to hold his hand steady. It also made his job as a mechanic nearly impossible. It eventually got to work. You could not get a nut on a bowl, or, you know, if you did, it was going to take you four or five times as long. He tried medicines, which eventually stopped working. Then his tremor got so bad, he couldn't even carry out basic functions. My wife actually had to feed me. His son saw that a medical center in Virginia was offering a new treatment called High Intensity Focused Ultrasound, or HIFU for short. But the waiting list was immense. I was like 90-something on a list of 400-something. Then the Rockefeller Neuroscience Institute at West Virginia University started up a program. Don wouldn't have to wait. He'd be their first patient. They asked him if they could film the treatment. And I said, well, sure. And they said, especially since you're the first. And I thought, what? <laughs> The three-hour procedure involves wearing a special helmet in an MRI machine. The helmet beams ultrasound waves, the same type of sound wave energy used to look at the heart or developing baby, but turned up intensely to generate heat. This technology allows these thousand ultrasound beams to converge together at one point in the brain, in this specific case, the area generating the tremor. The area the doctors are targeting with the ultrasound is this oval structure deep in the brain called the thalamus. It's a big hub connecting nerves for movement, sensation, coordination, consciousness, and thinking. The nerves behind the tremors back and forth or oscillatory movement come through the thalamus. And if we disrupt that, it really stops the oscillatory kind of movement. The doctors apply the HIFU, then pull Don out of the scanner to check his response. He had four rounds, and each time the tremor tapered off more and more. I was expecting improvement. But the amount of improvement I got, I'm just amazed. And there was absolutely no pain involved. All of them on the table, their tremor stops. And we may have to make adjustments. And then if the temporary benefits look good, then we make a permanent scar. Some people told me there was several people in there that were so happy for me. And they told me they couldn't help but cry. It doesn't require surgery. So you're not cutting the skin. Or in this case, uh, you're not putting a hole on the skull. But you do have to be able to lie flat, and your skull can't be too thick, or the sound waves won't penetrate properly. In general, uh, we get a 70% reduction in tremor. A small number of patients may require another focused ultrasound treatment if the tremor comes back. The limitation of high-frequency ultrasound is we really can only do it one side safely. We never like to create two lesions. The biggest risk is a 1% to 2% chance of patients having some unsteadiness and walking difficulties that uh, take some time to recover. It is FDA approved, but Medicare may not cover it in some states. In West Virginia, coverage has not been a problem, so people from other states with essential tremor are now coming there for HIFU. I was hoping just to be able to eat something, not be completely still, which I'm not 100% still, but I'm at least 97 percent. We went to the beach here a couple of weeks ago, and I wasn't embarrassed about going out and eating in the restaurants. It had been a long time since I was relaxed like that, and thinking I can go out there and you know, I can get this food up in my mouth without throwing it all over the floor. Just one of the many difficult tasks for people like Don, made simple again through this breakthrough treatment. I'm Dr. Maria Sembra, KDKA News.